right, what is up? Welcome at the new video. Today we are already in Spain in our house. Later on I will do for sure some tour of this house to show you around how it look like because we have this house rented for one month now and maybe we will see, maybe we will stay longer. Now is the plan that we're gonna change the tires because we have been practicing already one day at the spot here in uh, Calafal which is close to Barcelona. We are in Spain already I think four or five days let's say almost a week. I haven't recorded any vlog from this because we had a small issue with Philip which is the camera guy which always record every my vlogs. He basically had to leave from Italy straight home because of some family issues. So now we have to film everything by ourselves but we will get used to it it's also a good experience and uh, I haven't filled anything because I just wanted to enjoy at least the one week of camera and uh, focus on you know getting the energy from this beautiful Spain because it's so amazing out there the Sun people, weather, everything is so amazing. This morning we have been already with Virgis running like seven kilometers, then a cold pool and then yoga. So this is so perfect for me. I mean, I love it absolutely out there. And <laughs> I'm already thinking about to buying some house over here because this is so nice. I mean, like I like Czech Republic, but this place is different bread. <laughs> so from last practice, the tire end up like that. So I have to take out the tire changing machine, remove the wheel and then we're gonna change inside. Only thing which is kind of bad for me, that boys can park inside in our, let's say, garden. But my van is too high, so I cannot fit in there, so I have to park here on the streets. But I figured out that I don't have to unload the bike for changing the tire, so I'm just gonna change it right away here Can someone please open? You don't want to be friend anymore no, that you I'm close sorry, the sorry. door? This was wind. Uh huh, yeah, for sure. Easy. Just like that. No matter go. You can do it. This one is full itself. It was probably the winter summer outside. <laughs> you can check. For a few years. That was not easy. Kaboom! This one was harder. Flip flop power. <laughs> yeah. And you see in India riding on a bike with flip flops. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so after this tire changing, we had a nice barbecue, you know, catching the Fast and Furious vibe and let's move on to another day. Good morning, we are out here in Spain. I'm finally back to vlogging and we are starting our morning with the beautiful run next to the sea. Let's go.
So as you could see, our mornings are literally amazing. I love them. You know, we usually run, then cold pool, or we do bicycles instead of the running, and it's fucking amazing. But now it's already 12 o'clock, and we need to go to practice on more cycles. So we are heading now to the spot, and I will show you how the spot looks like because it's one of the best spots which I have ever seen and I have ever been practicing on. So I, every time when we go there, I'm really excited and I'm learning already a new trick, which is like one of my, let's say, dream, dream tricks. I will show you what is it. We just arrived at the riding area. So I will unload the bikes from the van or at least one bike. I think today we're gonna use just Triumph. So I'm gonna unload the Triumph. I'm gonna gear up for riding. And I'm gonna show you how this spot looks like because it's really amazing. My bike is out and I need to fix this damage from it's away because it's really pissing me off when I'm riding. So, ho, 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 the tires. So, you are left handed, yeah? Yeah. Strange. Professional drift mounting system. Professional left-hander. Oh shit! That wasn't really planned, but it works. If it works, it works. If you can fix it with the zip ties, hammer, and duct tape, you cannot fix it. <laughs> you cannot fix it, or you don't use enough. Yeah. Zip ties, hammer, and scotch. Solid. No more wiggle wiggle. Yeah, it works. Bro. That's right. So we are practicing already and uh, I just wanted to let you know that this practice video is not gonna be like that from Italy when you see a lot of riding and stuff because I came here to the Spain for practicing to learn two tricks which I really wanted to learn and I started with the hardest one which is called Watchtower. I will add clip here how it should look like because our buddy Vergis do it. And I'm still practicing that, so now I will try to put the camera somewhere and uh, maybe let's get a few shots how it goes. Alright, let's start with that shit.
Uh, this trick is really hard and it's really pain to do it like still you know like 20,000 <laughs> tries because it's really hard for the arm pump because you still have one finger on the clutch second on the handbrake and you still have to pump the handbrake and it's uh, I really tired from this and I'm still missing the one step, the most important one to put the second uh, feet on a bar. Uh, okay, let me give a few re minute rest and then we're gonna try again. What have you done? I used my Milwaukee knife. <laughs> <laughs> now, lucky man, because I have another tire! <laughs> I've been practicing but today is not the day of the watchtower because I don't feel comfortable today on a bike so let's pass it for another day but I have found out really fun on this spot how big is it we can do power slides from really high speed and I'm gonna show you this is so much fun <laughs> So we just arrived back at our house here in Spain in Calafal and I just want to tell you a quick story and what's actually happening. So we have been in uh, Italy for competition in Verona, uh, as you could see maybe from Instagram stories and stuff. And uh, together with me was a Philip video maker which was on the whole this trip with me, we have planned everything and he basically makes most of my videos. But he had a problem with uh, something in a family and uh, he needed to go back to Czech Republic as soon as possible and that's why all the plans are changing now. So I dropped him at one place and later on, I think second day, he went home back to Czech Republic and now I'm here alone recording everything I like uh, as I can but still it was kind of sad for me so I had like like one week break from vlogs I just wanted to chill out uh, take it more as a holiday at least for the one week here in Spain so now I have finally time back to do vlogs it's not gonna be that much vlogs as I have planned before because you know it's kind of hard to record everything by ourselves because having a video maker which can still film something and do the editing and everything is like biggest help which you can have as a youtuber so i hope that philip will uh, solve everything at his family and everything will be good i hope so let's pray for that and now we have to move on uh, so i'm gonna edit this video and upload it to you as soon as possible but one thing which i want to tell is the most important thing we got already two vlogs recorded from the verona from italy but they are not gonna be sooner uploaded in this video which I'm recording now because this footage I already have at me and I can edit it right now but the other footage from Italy is still at Philips SD card so he needs to send it me or he needs to edit it where he will have time so this is gonna be kind of sketchy that I'm gonna upload video from Spain and already later on will be video from Italy where I have been before but it doesn't matter, I just still want to upload it. We had a lot of fun here in Italy, or in Italy itself, because at competition I crashed into the car and stuff like that. It was crazy. You will see in the vlog. I'm kind of sad that I haven't vlogged in Monaco, because we have been in Monaco for one day, almost full day, and we actually had there like one of our best experiences in my life, because we met one guy, uh, through the TikTok, Raul, and uh, he do drifting in his uh, Ferrari F40, which is like extremely rare car, and for us who likes the car culture and everything, is like the one of the best cars which you can actually get. And this guy is crazy. He do drifting with that. He just have big collection of really rare cars. 
and I d haven't recorded anything just on my phone but I'm not gonna post it in there. Nerius, my friend here from Lithuania, he recorded almost everything on his camera and he has the same camera as I have so you can check his YouTube channel because he yesterday uploaded the whole vlog from Monaco. So that's gonna be everything, I'm gonna cook some dinner, have fun and see you probably tomorrow or another day. Alright, have a good day, bye guys. And don't forget, like, like, subscribe and comment. Peace!